It's here on the left. It's going to be here. Where is it? it should be here. 16, 66, 64 is this one. The Get the warrant. Let's go and see if he's in. Anything out of that fence? No? No. Nah, nothing there. I'll try this one. What do you reckon, Dave? Anything down there? Right, there's one beyond the digger. Do you reckon he'd get a caravan in between there? No, nah, I don't think he'll get down there. No, he hasn't, has he? All right, let's go and knock the door then. Here's a warrant here. Cheers, mate. Michael Ford in it, I think he is. Yeah, is Michael Ford in, please? No, who are you? Repossession, guys. Come bailiffs again, okay. We're not bailiffs, we're repossession, guys. There's a big difference. Well, what are you after? We're after his caravan. Well, he ain't here. Well, we've had a look over the fence. I know you've looked over my fence. Well, where's the caravan? Ever since he watched that documentary, Freeman of the Land, he's gone AWOL. He ain't here. Where is he? He's going to be down his field in that caravan you're after. Where's the field? Well, if you go down here, there's a school on the right, and it's on the left, just down and opposite. And is there a track? Yeah, there's a track down there. It is gated off, but you'll get access easily. What car's he driving? It's an old maroon Volvo. Last time I seen him in it. Is he down there on his own? As far as I know, he don't see no one. He just turns up there randomly. He doesn't believe in civilised law anymore or anything. I don't know what he's got down there. OK, fair enough. Is he the only one there? Don't know, I haven't seen him. All right, Colin, let's go then. Apparently he's not married anymore. She ain't happy, is she? Simon David, you ever heard of Free Man of the Land? Up until then I hadn't. Bit weird. Well, they just don't abide by common law. I mean, they don't accept authority, they just don't accept the government, they just don't accept anything, really. I mean, say, for instance, we turn up on a job and someone called the police, because they wouldn't call the police. We're rolling around on the floor with them. We could even be getting the better of them, but they wouldn't accept that the police are there to help them. They're just... Oddball. That's rich coming from you, Dave. Go and have a look down there, Dave. Can you see anything down there? Yeah, looks like it's down here, yeah. Where's the track go? Just down to the left. Dave, there's definitely a caravan over there. Yeah. Maroon Volvo? Yeah, Maroon Volvo. Go and introduce ourselves, eh? Good to go? All good. Yeah, give us a pay point. Michael Ford? No, who's asking? We've got a repossession warrant for your caravan. Yeah, walking up on me a bit, uh, you know, dodgy mate, you know. Just spoke to your wife. What wife? I ain't got a wife. We just been to your house? I ain't got a house. That's cool. my house. That's a caravan. Yeah, I know, it's a house. Well, there's a repossession warrant for it. I don't, I don't understand. Yeah, there's your warrant. Dave, go and check the... That's for Michael the Ford. Numbers. Yeah, but you're Michael Ford. No, I've told you I ain't. You are Michael Ford? No, I'm not. I've, I've sent my birth certificate back. I've, I've rescinded my driving licence. I'm, I'm no longer that guy. I'm not him. 
But when you took out the finance for the caravan, what name was it under? Well, I didn't take it out. Michael Ford did. Not yeah, but you're Michael Ford. No, I'm not. I'm not. Why not? Because I'm not known as that. You know, when they give you a birth certificate and they say you're such and such, you're, you're too young to confirm it. I mean, I'd, I'd just been born. I don't even know my date of birth. That's just hearsay. It's what people have been telling me all my life, but I, I have, I've never confirmed it. So I'm not that well, guy. Of course you know what day you're born. No, how, how, how so would I know? So you're disputing now what day you're born? Well, yeah, of course I am. And it's now a... you're not Michael Falls? No, I'm not. No. I've sent, it, I've sent everything back that I need to. I, I'm, I'm no longer that guy. I don't, I don't answer to that guy. He's, he's not me. Can you find it, Dave? He's ground it off. You ground the serial number off? I didn't grind it off. What makes you think I ground oh, it well, off? Oh, well, Michael Ford ground it off before you changed the name. Well, there you go, then. You that, that ain't the caravan you're looking for, is it? Right, let's have a look. There's normally another serial number under there. There you are. Stay with the customer. What's all this about? Why? Who's my, you know, why aren't you being Michael Ford? It's like this. You're only governed by the law if you consent to it. If you don't consent to it, you're not governed by the normal laws. You're only governed by, you know, just common law. Like, you, you won't harm another fellow man. You won't steal from somebody. Uh, but all the other things that they throw to you, yeah. it's consensual. And if you don't consent to it, if you send your birth certificate back, if you just turn your back on the whole system, you haven't got to comply to it. So how, how do you go about doing this? Like, what do you, what well, do, you, you do? You can start off. I mean, classic thing is your driver's licence, right? That, yeah. That's that's the you know, using all legal documents as an identity. Yeah. But driving licence in itself, if you look at it, if you look at the legal definition of driver licence, it's a licence that you need to drive a vehicle for high reward. Mm. If you're just driving your vehicle from A to B as transport, yeah. you don't need a driver's licence because oh, you're right. not doing it for high reward. But what but, if the police stop you then? What, what happens then? Well, that's not the law I'm governed by. I've, I've, I've turned me back on all that because I don't agree with it. It's just to, it's just to earn the machine money. It's, it's, you know, it, it, it's not for my own welfare. All oh, right, Dave. You what know? are you doing? And, and just learning about this free man of the free man. Oh, get out! He's interested. What do you mean he's interesting? He's supposed to be doing a repossession, not a show and tell. What is he? You bloody slave or something? He's supposed to be working for me. Mate, this is what this is what it's all about. Yeah, you're, it's you're being a slave to the machine here, mate. You know, which means he works for me. He's not a slave. I pay him. Look, you ground the serial number off. Right? No, Michael Ford must have ground the serial number off. I've yeah, got nothing to do with that. you, Michael Ford doesn't exist. Well, I'm not Michael Ford. I didn't say he didn't exist. It's not me. That's what I'm saying. My serial numbers on the inside of that caravan. That belongs to Michael Ford. You're Michael Ford. Right, that is the one we're taking, all right? But no, because put it this way, the, the, the guy that I was acting on behalf of a couple of years ago paid half the payments towards that. What do you right. mean acting on behalf? So you was acting on behalf of yourself? When you took out the agreement, you was Michael Ford? Yeah, and Michael Ford paid for half that caravan. So if you're going to repossess that caravan, you need to give me half the money back. Yeah, but you're not Michael Ford, so you don't have half the money, do you? You give it me and I'll give it Michael Ford. But Michael Ford exists now, then, does he? And you can, I'm well, what you... saying hypothetically, you know, when you die, um, the money that you've got gets passed on to your siblings, doesn't it? But you're well, not Michael Ford. What are you going to do with the money? Apparently you don't have money. Well, I'm not going to do anything Michael Ford is. But Michael Ford doesn't exist according to you. No, I'm not Michael Ford. I oh, didn't say Dave, it didn't exist. I'm not putting up with this. Come on, I'll show you where the serial number is. Hey, no, you're, you're slaves, man. You're slaves. Simon, Dave, how many times have we turned up to jobs and the uh, serial numbers have been ground off? Loads. Gym equipment. Gym equipment's a good one. Yeah. They always take the serial numbers off or pop the tag off, don't they? And then they go, oh, it's not your one. That's with another finance company. What do I always say to you though? If it's on our wagon, it's ours. If it's in theirs place, it's theirs. It's no, definitely it's... ours though. What, the caravan? Yeah. Yeah, definitely. Well, we found the other serial number. But I had to bring you in to make sure because if we'd got it wrong, I mean, he didn't abide by the common law of the land, but he certainly knew it. I never knew there was two serial numbers on him. Yeah, we'd have been in big trouble if we hadn't found the other one. Well, I don't think we could have took it. No, I and mean, he was only following his own laws. Mm. Put it on there. Yeah, see you, mate. Just check it as well. Set. Oh, yeah, you ready? I can see it now, yeah. Just check, make sure it's the right one because this bloke is. Oh, man. Right. 
You see it? Yeah. Shove we've your head got under. It. Yeah. Six four three. Yeah. Seven two. Yeah. W T. W T. Yeah. R F. That's it. That's this it. This is us. We confirmed. Yeah. This is us. Definitely one hundred percent. One hundred percent. Yeah. Because you know he's going to kick off with a finance company. Yeah. This is ours. This is our van. He's going to say it's not him. Yeah. It's there. He didn't know about that one. Yeah. No. This is our van. Let's okay. take it. Let's hook it up. Let's give him the good news. Hi, right, Michael Ford. It's going. No, no, I right, man. No, it's mine. It's, it's off. Mine. No, it's going. It's all off. You. It's mine. You're not his fellow man now, are you, Dave? Dave. Stuff this. Piss in the jeep. Open the door. No, it's all off. Oh, she's so right to chat one of my agents on the floor, isn't it? That wasn't me. Open oh, yeah, the door. Break me arm, mate. Break it. Open the door now. You're showing your true colours now, ain't you? Let's hook it up, Sean. Let's take it. Let's hook it up. You can't take it. I'm in it. Let's go. You can't take me home. You can't do that, I'm in here! Oh, what are you doing? No! No! Get out of the caravan! No! Get out! I ain't, no! What would take you with us then? My caravan! Mine! It's not your caravan, it belongs to a finance company! No! No, it doesn't! Oh, it you owe me money! You owe me two grand! Yeah. That's going up. Go on, keep going. Keep going. That's it. Oh, I've had enough of this. Where are we going? Whoa, 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 Dave! Why is he in a tractor? Isn't that what. Can't you remember what happened? Oh, so he couldn't have. No, he couldn't have. Let's put him in the Volvo, shall we? Yeah. <laughs> See there. Ding. Oh, to Dave, he's coming in. What's he doing? What's he doing? Oh, come on. Let's get these legs up. Are you having for tea tonight then, Dave? Lasagna. Oh, your missus makes a lovely lasagna, doesn't she? Yeah, she does, yeah, yeah. Oh. Yeah. I'm a free man of the Yeah. What's that? Ah! Move! Do you think he's hurt? You think? Windscreen's gone through. I think he's dead. Mm. Oh, free man. Freeman Island. You certainly are, mate. You certainly are. He's all right, Dave. Get his caravan hooked up. Good 
to me. Whoa, whoa. You can keep that. Yeah. That's his off. I'm going to lose the door in a minute. 